Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to be going over a Harpies deck with some really crazy combos. There's uh, a little bit of a splash of um, a Dragoonity engine in here, or I guess maybe like a Dragon Link type of thing. We're playing uh, Crystron, Halky Fibrax, and basically the end board here, you're going to get your uh, Hot Red Dragon Archfiend dude out and basically make it so the opponent can't do anything against you. So getting started here, first thing we're going to need is Channeler and then just one card to discard. So we're going to normal summon that guy out. And then activate the effect to discard. We're going to summon Perfumer. And Perfumer's effect is going to let us search Egotist. We already had one in our hand, but hey, let's take another. Going to activate that to summon another Harpy Lady. Going to go with the vanilla here. Next, you're going to special summon into your, uh, your Raid Raptor there, the four Strix. You're going to search off your Raid Raptor, special summon him out, you're going to go into your other Raid Raptor, the Y Strix, activate the effect, you're going to search your uh, Blackwing uh, Zephyros, and XYZ into another 4 Strix, activate the effect, doesn't really matter who you detach here, uh, but you're going to search your Blackwing Chris there. Then his effect would activate to search that rank up card. Uh, we already had it in our hand, so it's already there to activate. Uh, we summon an XYZ back and then summon uh, Cyber Dragon Infinity on top of it, paying half your life points to do that. Um, now we're going to link two into Romulus. Romulus is going to search out our Divide Lance. Activate that to Romulus. And uh, Infinities just keep going to keep asking if we want to negate. Uh, we don't want to negate with it. Activating the Divine Lance to summon our uh, Phalanx. Phalanx is going to summon himself out there. Going to go to our graveyard. Uh, we're going to bounce a card back to our hand, pay 400, and then summon our Blackwing um, Zephyros dude back. And then we can summon our uh, Blackwing Chris, Crack of Dawn. All right, we're gonna go into our Samorg now, linking two guys into that for link three. Go into an LP. Summon DMZ Dragon from our deck. Activate the effect there to attach the Fair Links from the graveyard to it. And then summon the Fair Links back out. It's gonna be a lot of repeating of just, you know, summoning our Fair Links out, just an extender that goes crazy. Then we're going to Synchro into, uh, I don't know how to say its name, if it was Jarta, whatever you want to call it. Fair Lynx comes back, activate, to summon again. We're going to go ahead and Synchro again into a Borlo Savage Dragon. You know, activate his effect, get the Link Monster, attach it to him. Going to get a couple of negates there. Alright, next up we're going to go into Pisty. And then Pisty's going to get our DMZ back. DMZ is going to let us um, summon Fairlinx back. Really important that you equip the Fairlinx to the Borload Savage Dragon right here. And then we're going to go ahead and link all three of those guys off for a Triple Burst Dragon. Summon the Fairlinks back up, and then we're going to go into Crystron and Halka Fibrax. Uh, summon the second Fairlinks from the deck, and pass turn there. Samorg so is going to activate on end phased. We're going to summon our Mist Valley Apex Avian. So we have a lot of negates set up right here. Basically, the first thing that they do, uh, we're going to negate with Borlode Savage Dragon and then start chaining. Yes, we want to chain another card here. So we're activating Halk to be able to summon um, uh, Formula Synchron from our extra deck. 
And then it, when that's summoned, um, we can synchro immediately with it. Summon our hot rat dragon arch fiend dude. So the king calamity dude. Use his effect. Um, and then basically at this point, uh, the opponent is pretty much screwed. Uh, they can't really do anything. They're just going to set a bunch, pass turn. On their end phase, we're going to go Smorg. Summon our barrier statue, because why not? And then we have a ton of beefy monsters. Ecclesia can't be destroyed by extra deck monsters. Um, so we're going to, it's it's nice that we have the Apex Avian. Um, I, I did a play here with Harpy Harpy Queen, trying to get the, um, the field card out here and stuff. I didn't really need to do any of that. I could have just probably attacked and stuff, but I was just trying to kind of set up for if they had negates going. I used the Solemn Judgment. Go straight to battle phase and then um, attack over Ecclesia. And then pretty much uh, attack for game here. So Crazy combo. Never thought you'd see Harpies do it, huh? Well, thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, uh, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel.